a nightmare. Yeah, you finally realize. <sighs> I can't believe I'm watching something so precious just disintegrate like this, you know? Do you know what it's like for me to see Bobby humiliate herself? To see the mother of my children, a woman that has shared my life with, and she doesn't have a shred of dignity. She doesn't have one shred of dignity left because of him. Then why do you feel like you have to punish her also? I guess self-preservation. Well, you know, it could be self-preservation. I, I know that, that when I lost my baby, I had an awful lot of anger inside of me, and there was no rationalizing that loss. And I remember feeling the same way at PJ's service. I thought, why PJ? Why so young? But there's no answer, you know? There's no answer to it. It's all so useless, and all that anger is just inside of me. You don't know what to do with it. Go on. Tony, I know how hard this must be for somebody like you, too. Because your intellect says that, that there's no reason for this. But your heart won't accept that. And you can't punish fate or God or death. So you have to just find the easiest and most vulnerable thing to lash out at, and that's Bobby. And Tony, knowing what I know, I know in the depths of my heart, from the very depths of my heart, that neither one of you are going to be able to heal until you find your way back to each other. You are so lost. 